Oh, hell right you guys, we are gonna be paying attention to this Russian kid again. Some would have guessed he's from Chernobyl, Ukraine, but he's actually from Russia. And in Russia, the oil invades you. Anyway, so in this video he prepares for his next oil change. He works out at the gym, but no matter how hard he trains, he still has less definition than a pageless dictionary. Many people didn't know this, but he's also a personal trainer. He helps women to lose weight and to get in shape. Every time they see him, they run. So when he went back to the locker room, he got in a fight with another gym member. At this moment, nothing seemed all right anymore. A gym is not the right place for rage attacks, especially not in Russia. They have CSGO for that. <laughs> Some minutes later, one of his eyes turned black. Call him Bruce Oil Lee or Oil Clops. For the first time in his life, he felt like a famous celebrity. In this case, like Rihanna after she got beaten by Chris Brown. People have gone to wars for less oil than what's in his arms. When he takes the bus, the bus driver gets confused and concerned, because he cannot tell where the smell of oil comes from. The next day, he started to feel the pain of the fight, and the oil entered his head and damaged his brain, as you can see here. Just joking, no brain was damaged, because he didn't even have one in the first place. He keeps flexing with things like a backpack, a phone or a watch. Many people can afford to watch, but not everyone can afford a brain. And only great minds can afford a simple style. Even though he has two expensive watches on his arms, he still does know when it's time to grow up. Next thing you know, he shows off his new girlfriend that he feeds with money. A bucket at KFC is worth more than a fake girlfriend. Because a bucket costs less, inside there are bigger breasts and less bones. With that much oil in his arms, he could go to Ukraine and open a fast food restaurant. He should call it KFC. But maybe it wouldn't work that well, because people of Ukraine are already tired of seeing natural disasters. In this video he got stopped by the mall security because it's illegal to be stupid. You need to pass an IQ test before entering and he failed. Just joking, he was stopped because he refused to wear a mask. But not because they were afraid to catch a virus, they wanted him to wear a mask because they were already tired of seeing his face again. Anyway you guys, always remember, at the end of the day it's night and every little thing is gonna be oil right. It's gonna be oil right. Nobody wants to get close to the end.